I want to thank all the uh, um, friends uh, that are here today, uh, the media who have co closely followed this story since uh, early February. Uh, but I think I most have or have to most thank, uh, be thankful to Javier and uh, Juan Jose for sharing time um, as they rehabilitate their lives after this tragic event. I am so proud and surprised of the outreach and the support that uh, has come from UFCW Canada members across the country, from coast to coast, from our local unions, from the, labor, the broader labor community, and from individuals, and quite frankly, unexpected individuals who made contributions to this fund. We saw community groups, the Latino community in, in Waterloo raised $10,000 at an event. We saw a law firm in Toronto, the um, Carazana Law Firm, um, hold events um, um, that raised over $10,000. Those uh, uh, groups contributed their money to the fund so that centrally there could be one presentation. So we're proud to be here on not only on behalf of ourselves, but on all the people that have made presentations to this fund. As a result of this support from Canadians, we were able to raise over $210,000 for the surviving workers and the family of the workers that were killed on February the 6th. I am honored and humbled to be here this morning to present the first two checks of this distribution to Javier and Juan Jose. But we want you to accept these gifts on behalf of the caring and loving people, union members, non-union members from across Canada who contributed to the fund uh, and hope that it helps you on your journey ahead. De la persona, de la clase de personas que he conocido, que Dios me ha dado esa oportunidad de, de sobrevivir, no saber o por qué estamos vivos nosotros. Con ese propósito de mantenernos con vida, ese testimonio de vida, de lucha, y agradecimiento para todos ustedes. De verdad, muchas gracias a todos por haber hecho posible. I am a testament of life, I am a testament of hope, I am a testament of, uh, of living through this tragedy. I really don't know why I'm alive, I don't know um, what my purpose is, but I do know that uh, it's, it's God's will and uh, that my, my testament is I will make sure that everyone hears about this and that I take this back home and that I can share my experiences here with everyone I meet for the rest of my life. Yo agradezco igual a todas las personas que hicieron posible reunir este dinero que nos va a servir para poder facilitar en algo la ayuda a nuestras familias. Pero al igual que mi compañero experiencia vivida después del, del choque fue terrible para mí puesto que yo estaba muriendo y no y tenía razones muy grandes por seguir en este mundo y eran mis hijos yo me perdonó la vida y me tiene hoy aquí conociendo a muchas personas nuevas para mí y saludos especiales a mis compatriotas Milagro, a mi compatriota Maritza, a mis amigos Carlos, a su familia, a la señora Vivian y una vez más al padre Ron, al que es pastor de una iglesia evangélica, el padre Pedro de la iglesia católica y a, a, a todas las personas que hicieron posible que nuestra estadía en este país fuera cada vez mejor. Y en sí, muchas gracias a todos, al presidente por haber reunido. Y gracias en verdad por todo. Thank you to us. Thank you to everyone who, uh, who collected funds for, for these donations and uh, thank you to all the communities, to the union president, to everyone who's here today to help us out. 
I echo what my coworker has said here in terms of the thank yous, but I also remember being in that car and thinking that I was going to I remember being in that car and uh, thinking that I was going to die, but for some reason, God wanted me to live, and so I did. And I lived for my two children. He has a 14-year-old and a nine-month-old. And uh, for them, I am here today. And uh, and I thank you so much for uh, for your support. To Milagro, to Maritza, to Marilu, to all my friends to everyone who has supported me and everyone who is here today.